Good Sunday morning, June 27th, on this warm, humid Sunday morning. Today we're at Northern Secondary School, 851 Mount Pleasant Road in Midtown Toronto. external walk today around this rather large high school situated between Roehampton Avenue and Broadway just north of Eglinton Avenue East I believe there's well over 2,000 students at this school. So it is like a city within a city in many ways. Northern Secondary are called the Red Knights. And their once rivals just west of here is North Toronto Collegiate Institute, and they are called the Norsemen. North Toronto is just west of here up Roehampton Avenue. The school has been quiet the last few months due to COVID protocol. So students have not been attending school the last few months. Beautiful architecture, Gothic style. School occupies an entire city block. I just wanted to get this memorial in recognition of the tragedy out in BC and Saskatchewan, but this came up before Saskatchewan's residential school deaths were discovered 
This is a memorial to the 215 residential school victims that were discovered in mass graves in British Columbia. And since then, Saskatchewan, where there was over 751 remains found. Pleased to see the school is recognizing and showing their support to the indigenous communities and teaching all of us the terrible lesson that we should all learn and know about. This portion of the school is called Gasoline Alley, which is to the east, in between the school itself and the the football field, the multi-purpose field. These garage doors you see here are entrances to classrooms where they have shop classes in shop mechanics, woodworking, We're just entering the multi-purpose field. Glad to see the field being used after months of inactivity. This field is named after Clark Pulford, the late Clark Pulford, who was a longtime football coach and athletic director at Northern. He is the brother of Bob Pulford, Leaf legend. President, general manager, and I believe coach at one time of the Los Angeles Kings. students who played on this field from football to soccer track and field went on to become great professionals and university collegiate players just now walking toward Broadway Avenue, which is to the north. Of the school.
we'll make our way back to Mount Pleasant Road and conclude our walk where we began at the front doors of Northern Secondary School. school now is surrounded by a massive development of condominiums with now the development of Young and Eglinton and the Metrolinx line, TTC line, has attracted much development so the school will be in great demand in the years ahead with this mass development. community garden being attended to by volunteers see the gardens and supplies are provided by Whole Foods which are just located east of the school on Bayview Avenue and Broadway That will conclude our walk today around Northern Secondary School. Hope you enjoyed the walk, the external walk, and learning a little bit about this great institution in Midtown Toronto.